today we're playing The Sims Medieval, and I think we're gonna create a new sim. I think I think it's I think it's time. Plus, I have a really good idea. So let, let me find no, not the barracks, not the pavilion. No, I know that's an assassin. That's a healer and a wizard. Who's that? A mill? No. Lighthouse? No. Blacksmith? No. Mer market? No. Is it gonna be the last thing that I find? It is. Okay. So I've decided to place the tavern, place it furnished, because we need a bard. It's time. I love a bard. I actually haven't played a bard like in a tabletop game in ages. Actually, I don't know if I've actually technically played a bard. Now I, now I don't think I have, but I had a really good idea. So, go with me here. Princess Cordelia. We know her from The Sims 4. We know a lot of the lore. I know that technically she's been merged with Cordelia Thebe, and I could do that, but I want her name to be Princess Cordelia. I do. So yeah, I decided we're gonna do Princess Cordelia. She had an obsession with jazz music and like, it'd be funny to make her a bard. So I don't want her to be old. Cause this is like young Princess Cordelia who's kind of chaotic. I want her to be a little bit scrawny. Like she's, she's traveling the world with pirates, being mischievous. To that end, there's a lot of water references. She lives in a submersible. She plays marbles with mermaids. Like, it's important. But I also think that she should be something music related. Okay, I can't do that. Hmm. I don't think she'd be scholarly. I guess fun loving? Maybe friendly. No, I think fun loving is better. Now. She could be cursed. She could also be a fool because I could see her being a little bit scatterbrained. I don't think she'd be filled with hubris. She is, she's got three pirate boyfriends, so she could be licentious, but I hate saying that word. I kind of want to do fool. I just think it would be funny. She's going to be a fool. We love you, Cordelia, but you're, you're kind of foolish. All right, we're gonna either do brown or red. Or not brown, blonde or red, because that's that particular family. Uh, she also really likes jewels. That's a thing that's specified about her, so like, oh. I kind of liked the brow we had with the, the slice. Yeah. It's good. Um, in terms of face, like, not like super particular. I do think she should have gray eyes like most of the caps. Can we have an obnoxious nose? Can I turn her? Oh, I can. Oh, she's already got a good nose. That's a great nose. We aren't taking that nose away. I like that mouth. Uh, I'm not gonna put makeup on her. There's so many good clothes. I was talking about this the other day, how there like, is so many amazing outfits that haven't been converted. It seems like a lot of these have been converted though. I have that for Sims 2. I don't have that. That's a cute outfit. Ooh, I don't have that one either. And that's very piratey. And I think that's what we're gonna go with, but. That's also very cute. I don't have that one. I'm taking it back. I thought I had them all. Okay, I I wouldn't necessarily need this one, but like I would not complain about it. And the bells are kind of everything. Similar things have been converted. I think that's been converted. I think that has, no, I don't think that has. Okay, I take it back. A lot of these have not been converted. I, I would love to learn, but like, 
the way that I learn things is just not through tutorials. I try so hard and like sometimes I make it work. Most of the time I don't. Okay, the jewel in her head needs to now be a different color. Because I'm sorry, Cordelia would make sure it matched. Could be a blue jewel. She looks kind of cranky. I love that nose, and but I just don't think. But I think the mouth is. Gonna be a happier man, no. Mm -hmm. Okay, it can't be any closer. Is it the brows that are too angry? Like. to look a little sweeter. I think I'm gonna have to give up the nose. I do love the nose, like that was a great nose, but yeah, she just needs to look a little softer. A little softer. Maybe we should give her some. I mean, why not? She's being a pirate. She's a princess. If anyone can have anachristic, Is that how you... I don't know how you say that, but like, she could have the eyeliner. I kind of want to change that blonde. I just don't think it's cute. I'll just give her white blonde hair. Go full Targaryen. Alright, I like that one a little bit better. Alright, I think that that is our Princess Cordelia. Let's see what kind of mischief we can get up to with her. Okay, so one, we're skipping that one. Two, three, four, five, six. Those two are new. Let's see, if we end up with Royal Holiday, we might not be playing with Cordelia today. We are skipping, of course, Ominous Tides because I don't want to start a war yet. All right, I rolled, we got a three. So one, two, three, Family Crest. Okay, I think that is Royal. We're not gonna be playing with our lovely little, ooh, there is at one point, Night heraldry. I'm gonna go with what the dice decided. But maybe next time we can play with Cordelia. <laughs> I wanted to make her at least. Okay. Oh god, see, look at these outfits. Stunning. Stunning. Can you imagine that? The chain of office, the slashing, the stripes. There's even like a little chainy belt moment for no reason. Love that. The ruffled collar. <sighs> Dreams. Okay. So, something had been bothering Lady Raven Dancer. There was whisper among the foreign dignitaries that her rule was a sham because the queen had had no royal crest to display her family's heritage. How dare you? How dare you? Actually, just because Wales ate my parents doesn't mean you could behave that way. How about, what is your name? Cordell. Oh god, I forgot. Yeah, and look at his. He's also got a chain of office, and so he's got like an interesting belt with 3D details, and then the fur and the boots. This is just me obsessing about random fashions. I love that hat, by the way. All right, Cordell. What do you got for me, buddy? Perhaps you can send a pigeon to some of your relatives and have them bring your crest? Why do they have my crest? Why can't I just, I don't know, draw it myself? Who's that? The merchant princess Jolene. Jolene Fame. She's very pretty, and she has a really cool outfit. Oh, and look at the, the snood with the little roll. Okay, I need to stop. I need to stop. 
Listen, you know who I am. You know this is how I behave. So I'm gonna write a letter to my relatives. What am I complaining about? Oh, I got scratched. Come on now. That was quick. So mail it. She knows how to write a letter. There, I've sent off a letter to my relatives that I know of. Ha! It should only be a matter of time before they come to my aid. I should ask my subjects to prepare for their arrival. Okay. More cool clothes? Look at the cup! And the and the shoes! Like, they really did the thing. Like, look at that outfit. Alewife Ida looks amazing. I don't know what those two are doing, but she looks at me. I think he's also staring at her shoes going, those are so cool. Even like the plain peasant outfit. Laura looks fantastic. Unfortunately, I think I'm gonna have to put her to work. Okay, so you need to prepare for my relative. I also gotta ask him. Right away, my lady. Yeah, um, young man, young man, young woman, young queen. You need to go tell him that too, and then you can go to sleep. Because I see that you are actually exhausted. Okay, my relative has arrived, and I should welcome him. Well, we can take a nap first. We are a queen. Look at that wall hanging! The coolness. I don't think that's been converted either. I know that has, but like, kind of weirdly in grayscale, not in color. Also the corner fireplace with the shield on it. It's just me appreciating this game. <laughs> That's what this playthrough is. Oh, and the table! I didn't even notice the little... I have a problem and that problem is this game. All right. I don't even see it as a problem. It's just like a fun little interlude while I deal with life, the universe, and everything. I still haven't taken the time. Also, I don't know if you noticed the about but yeah, I still haven't taken the time to reformat format the hard drive that I have, which is unfortunate, but like I'm also just scared that I'm not gonna be able to recover what I need to recover, so I'm putting it off. Okay, now. Oh, did they. Okay, no, they're still here. I was like, oh. Okay, they just came in. I was gonna go get you. You don't look like you are related to me. You look very smarmy. What is your name? Cousin Jace? Welcome, but like, also, I don't trust you. Look at the cards. Okay. Okay. I don't remember this relative. Odd, but if he received my letter, then he must be related to me, right? I should ask him about the family crest. I don't trust this man. I do not trust this man. He has a great nose, but he is untrustworthy. What do you have to say for yourself? Sorry, cousin, I don't actually have it. It's all in my memory. Let's talk about all this business later. Come, show me your kingdom. Okay, I'm supposed to go follow him to the town square. Do not trust. The gathered skirt. Well, I guess we don't have to get right down to business this second. Oh, there's Cordelia! Hey, Cordelia! Hi, hi, look at you. You look amazing with your sword. Ugh. Incredible. Incredible. We will get back to you. Lady Raven Dancer, you also look incredible, but like. I've seen you. <laughs> I don't think her hair has been converted either. I need to learn things. Learning is hard. Oh, that bridge is pretty. 
it really is a pretty game. Like, this is what I wanted Sims 3 to be. But I just, it's too, something with these skin tones, they're just, they don't look as Play-Doh-y, whereas Sims 3 is just like, horrific to me. Who is that man? Hello, hello, hello. Merchant Waylon. You look like you could be Lan from Wheel of Time in another world. Also, hi, Town Crier Orlando. I don't know why you're glowing. Ah, the town square, the heart of the city. This has always been my favorite place. Been a favorite place of mine. I wonder if my relative agrees. He better. I know he's thinking about dragons, but he best love this place. I don't know why that man is glowing. Look, look at him. He's glowing. I mean, he's beautiful, but why? Ooh, great hair, too. Okay, focus. Focus. Ugh, it smells like craft hole, and it's about as exciting as a Peter and Sermon. Maybe we can do something to add a little action. Cousin, go spit in the well. <gasps> Uh-oh, peer pressure. Where's my dice? So we can either spit in the well, which is gross, or not spit in the well. Four, one, two, oh, we're gonna spit in the well. Lady Raven Dancer, she would though. Spit in the well. Is it gonna show? Okay. Ha, I know you were in a stick in the mud. Classic, now spit in one of these peasants' faces. Okay, she's monarch level four, that's great. But like, oh dear, a peasant's face? Oh, why is him, what's his obsession with spitting? Is it a thing? Does he have a thing? Does this man have a thing? And she's indulging in it without knowing it. One, okay. Now that's taking it too far. Come on, let's just see the rest of the kingdom. Yeah, let's not spit in somebody's face. Not here for it. Oh, all right. Let's see the rest of Crafthole's smellier brethren. Or smellier brother, present villa. Sorry, again, the size struggle is real. So we're gonna take him to the docks and maybe drown him, because how dare you. Quickly! Who is she? Hi! Consort Linoda. I don't know you're a consort of, not me! But you definitely could be, if you want to. I'm just saying. I'm queen. Okay, so yay, we're here at the docks. He's just whittling. That would be a cool idle animation. Like, replace the little cube with just a block of wood. I don't want to talk to this man anymore. I would love to talk to this lovely, lovely potential pirate queen. I don't know. And he says it smells. He wants to send our servant to the stocks? Laura? We love Laura. Why would we... Oh dear. He's a bad influence. Oh gosh. Please, dice gods, be kind. No! I rolled a six. Laura, honey, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I am so sorry to this woman that we have to send her to the stocks. I'm sorry. I'm so Raven Dancer, why? Uh oh, didn't see that coming, did ya? Haha, <laughs> come on, cousin, let's go throw things at her. Oh gosh. Golly gee, Willikers, I don't like that. Please, please, dice gods, please. Okay, we rolled a five. That's enough, cousin. This is getting old now. Like, she'll go along a little bit, but he just keeps pushing it. Can I say hi to this woman? Like, hi. How are ya? Can I know you? Okay, she ran away. 
Just when things get good, you have to be such a buzzkill. Whatever, I'm gonna go wander around this mega craft hole by myself. I don't appreciate that man. Okay, go back to the throne room. <laughs> Sing the kingdom is fine, but I want my crest and I want it now. Must stay calm. Remember, I need that man to validate my family's history. While he's out wasting more time, I should see if anyone here knows anything about him. Oh yeah, because, okay. I was gonna say that looked like my servant for a minute, but actually Georgia is from Craft Hole. And you know, you were being insulted quite a bit. It's Cheekbones. Hi Cheekbones. What is your name? Scallywag Alta. Listen, you can be whatever you want, Alta. You can do whatever you want. You have the cheekbones to do anything. Look at her feet. Wait a minute. Haven't people been asking? God, I'm just talking myself at this point, but like, I know that type of shoe. Someone had asked about it at some point. The things he has said about Crap Hole, you can't imagine. All right, let's go talk to Jolene. That man, that man, ugh, don't even get me started. I trust Jolene completely. Who do I need to go talk to? This human being. Hi, foreign dignities. So let's go talk to you. Oh, no, right. We're talking to him about it. I must speak with my relative when he gets back about the reactions from these dignitaries. Let's go talk to this man that I do not trust. Because I think he is a coward and a criminal, and he's not worthy of the nose. You're going to listen to them over your own family? I don't know, cousin, my memory is getting real hazy about that crest. Perhaps you can make this up to me and I'll remember a little clearer. Put him in the stocks. Okay. We're gonna make him dress nice or pro proclaim him the greatest cousin in all the land. We are going to give him a nice outfit. I was saving this for someone who really deserved it. I know you were. Can you go talk to Cordelia? Cause like, Look at her! She's baby! She's baby. She's like actual baby. We need to talk to our Lady Raven Dancer. Can we just like tell her a joke? Yes, yes we can. Oh, and hi! Hi friend! I would like to talk to you too. Because at some point I'm gonna need to be wed. So like, we should talk to people. Okay, so what do I gotta do now? Give him kingly clothing, Ugh, I guess. This trash fire of a man. There, he seems to be pleased again. I need to watch my step if I wanna ever get that crest. Maybe he's ready to give it to me now? Okay, quickly, I need to, I have five hours to write a treaty of ongoing peace, so I'm gonna do that. I don't know what that is. Oh, <gasps> that outfit. That outfit, that's so good. He does not deserve it, he is unworthy. Unworthy. Okay, cool. And then I need to, write some laws. She'll just be really bummed out if we don't do this. Okay, did you, did you? Okay, cool. All right, what do I want? I want food. Where's my little servant? Is she still in the stocks? Did we let her out yet? Who's this man? Look at his nose, Apothecary Chadwick. Look at that nose and this, this, the, the, the Mud choppies, that's too cute. Too cute, okay. I will make my own food. Let's do some whale soup. Where are you going? Why are you eating it in there? I mean, you're eating it with your hands, which is like gross, but also why? Where is he? Let's ask about the crest. Oh, 
that I'm just getting used to the royal life, cousin. Oh. Now I'm just getting used to the royal life? Cousin, I'll give you the crest later. Relax. This is infuriating. Time to broaden my investigation into my cousin. Ooh, what do we got? New outfit? New outfit? <gasps> Matt Cawthon would love this man. Look at the lace on those cuffs. Beautiful. Ugh, I'm, I am problematic, aren't I? I feel like I'm problematic. I just, I see the clothing. I see clothes in like pretty much anything and I just lose my little mind. Oh, it's the guy! Hey, guy! Odd, I just received a message about that very individual. And? What does the message say? The message was intercepted by a notorious Montebank, Duchess Beverly. I mean, I can I can think of some things. She looks so surprised. She's I mean, he's just over there being smug. That outfit has been converted. What is wrong with me? What is actually wrong with me? Okay, so I have to decide what to do with this man. So I can either throw him in the pit to die, or I could be merciful and exile him. Sorry, crossbones. Ooh, I really want to put him in the pit. Cousin Jace in the pit or Cousin Jace with the sword? Come on, pit. Yeah, pit beast. It's what he deserves. Wait, I gotta. Oh, it's too boring for your taste? Yeah, yeah. Okay, monarch, send to the pit. Come on, you just got taken for a ride. She's like, it was really easy to decide to murder that man. I see that. Who is that man behind you? There's a man behind you in a lovely green Goatkeeper Norman. That's a fancy outfit, Goatkeeper Norman. Bye, Felicia. Okay, and now what I want. Wait for him to be eaten. Um, okay, so do I go- oh, he's talking to people, okay. There, there it is. Where's my eye in the sky? Where's my pit? I always forget where the pit is. There's the pit! Let's go! Let's go, girls! Oh gosh, I gotta let her out. Is he already thrown in there? We missed it! We done missed it. <laughs> Aw, Cousin Jace, are you not having a fun time with the pit beast? Yeah. Squish him. Can we let this woman out? Release. Look at all the symbols. Okay, A, the symbols being all zodiac symbols is kind of cool. Look at that. Look at that. I think I have that actually. That looks semi familiar. I also feel like she's letting Laura go and she's like, listen, I'm so sorry. I, I'm easily influenced. I'm so sorry. She's angry, but we're going to pretend. She's like, I'm so sorry. How long is it going to take him to die? Hey, buddy. Serves him right. I intend to make a new crest, one that represents my own actions. Yay! 
That's great! And we're Monarch level 5! Love that. Um, how are we doing? So our knowledge is very high. We could do better with our security, well-being, culture. Because I was debating... Maybe doing a non-character addition. That would give us a lot of well-being and a little bit of culture. Um, what the lighthouse? Oh, and the mill. The mill would give us a ton of well-being. Lighthouse would give us a lot of security and a little bit of culture. I have 80. I think I'm gonna do the lighthouse. I think it's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's good. Okay. So now we have a lighthouse and a bard, and hopefully, wherever, where's the bard? There. Hopefully next time we can actually play with the bard. We will have to see. I'll keep you updated in terms of my data recovery shenanigans. But thank you so much for joining me. If you like this video, please do give it a like. It really does help. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.